What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another episode of our God of War walkthrough here on the PlayStation 5. Hope you all have an absolutely fantastic day. Picking up right where we left off, we got Mimir's head just decaying on our belt, and we're gonna go ahead and head down from the mountain. Oh, look, a chest. Translate those Muspelheim runes. Oh. Not that I want to go to Muspelheim, but cool. Do you remember the way to the witch's house? Yes. The woods with the blood red leaves. South of the lake. I know just where to go. Alright, lead the Hope way. She then. made it back from Alfheim and can bring Lemire back. He seemed nice. Before you cut off his head. Alright, we got a door. Nothing else over here? No? Okay. Nice, so now we want to go to over there. So we need to head to Box Shop. Look at this place. This must be a branch of the world tree. Boy, stay on the path. Right, right, I know. No, you want to go down there. Was Balder that came to our house. He ate you want, jump. Balder. Jump. You fought him and won. Yes. One of Odin's sons, Thor's brother. And now he's hunting us with his nephews. Why is this happening? If we can raise the head, you can ask him. Okay. You know, it's silly, but I secretly hope we find a giant somewhere in that mountain. I guess they really did leave Midgard, except for the serpent. He may be the last of his kind. Are you the last of your kind, too? Is that why you don't like to talk about- My kind? I mean, your family. Before Mother and I. Where you came from. Mother, the father? Now is not the time for that. Yes, sir. <laughs> Relax. Rock! 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 What? I'm on a fucking break. <laughs> Don't hear me screeching at you whenever you're twiddling your short and curlies. Leave him, boy. No, Beth. Well, you already soiled my solitude, so you may as well join me. You're not hungry. Good. It's Speak not what yourself. I was offering. Saw your brother again. Congratulations. And I'm sure you let him go and Roger my axe good and plenty again. Hmm? Let's see the damage. Tanker throat wouldn't know proper weight and balance if it were dangling off his chut. <clears throat> he eating well enough? I guess. Good. One smack. All better. <laughs> now what the fuck else you want, huh? Times he gets so wrapped up in his work, Sentry has it the sense to sip us up. And if he does remember, good luck getting him to cook his own meat. Guess I got all the stomach in the family. <laughs> you along with the smarts. You miss him. What, that spit mister? What do you know? I just mean that... Do you mind? Trying to concentrate here, already on a break from my break. All right, well, I got nothing left. <laughs> you take care now. Yeah, we will. Actually, first, let's, uh, let's get some skills. There we go. What's this one? Eh, 
What was this one? A boomerang. <laughs> Returning whirlwind. Okay. I mean, I might as well just get it. No, it's not. Let's do the cheap ones. Alright, what else we got? 4,500, 1,500, 1,500, uh, let's get the last one to Atreus, shock duration increased, shock arrows inflict more damage to enemies, oh that's still like 250, these are cheap. Nice. Oh, I should, uh... Oh, boy. Uh, yeah, give me that one. We need some luck. What about you, Atreus? Got anything? No? Okay. Good enough. Let's go. Boy, what is the path back to the witch? First we need to find a boat. Good. Do you remember the way back to the witch from here? That way. Behind the big statue of Thor. That way. Ooh, I see a chest. Hold one second, boy. So, Rock and Sindri made Mom the axe just to help her survive? We will continue another time. Uh. Oh, they're they're locked. Here, boy. It's some kind of dog. Aha. Thank you. Nice. More health. Up there. See it? See what? What do I see? I don't see anything, Atreus. You're crazy. Alright. Let's go, boy. We should explore a little bit, but I'll do that another time. Maybe I'll devote an episode to just doing side stuff. So, Rock and Sindri made Mom the axe just to help her survive? Do you have the strength to wield such a weapon and the wisdom to use it for good? She found purpose in protecting the weak. So, she'd help out the elves? No. Yes, we can. Huh? The water dropped. And the serpent rose. Right. I knew that.
Up we go, boy. I know she's really powerful, but you really think the witch can bring a head back to life? She seems competent in her craft, and we have nothing to lose. If she can't bring it back to life, can we keep the head? No. But you may feed it to the fish. Okay. Form him here. It's almost fish food. This will lead out. Oh, uh... yeah. Hey, this does more than decipher those loose belongings. It also contains the travel room. Should we go visit the fire room? Uh, no. <laughs> I'm good, thank you, though. Making sure there's nothing else. I don't know where this rune thing was, but whatever. Atreus, follow me. Sorry, I got distracted. Turn back, Ace. Guess the gods are welcome here. Remembers us. I'm sure he does. How's it going, Charlie? Is your witch friend here? What is that name? Uh -huh. That's what he told me it was. What it sounded like in my head, anyway. Charlie. I think that's um, a little reference to a, a person. They talked about it in the God of War documentary that they made. Um, it was like a fan of the game or whatever, so they honored him. I think. I could be wrong about that. does it say? Sir. Save their need things upon all who trespass. Oh, okay. Father! 
there. She is here. It is so good to see you again. I knew you weren't dead. <laughs> Hello. Oh, can you bring a head back to life? Uh, I'm not sure I understand what... Wait. Where did you get those? The arrows. Give them to me. Now. They were a gift. Do as she says, boy. These arrows are dangerous. They're wicked. You find any more, you destroy them, understand? Do you understand? Say it! I understand. If I see them, I'll destroy them. It's all I ask. Forgive me. Please, take my arrows in their place. I have no need for them anymore. Now, what's this about a head? Do you have any idea who this is? Did you kill him? At his request. He claimed you could revive him. Me? Are you sure you heard him right? Please? Take him to the table. Hey, Mille. It's been a long time since I've practiced the old magic. Hold him there. Let's have a look. Well... Thankfully, his head hasn't decayed much, and his brain is still intact. Nice clean cut. Cutting off his head of all people. I sure hope you know what you're doing. Now, hold his head under the water, and don't let go. I mean it. That's enough. It worked! Let me see him. Mamir? You there? Yes. Good. Oh. Mm. Hello, Freya. Been a long time. You look well. What I did, I did for them. As far as I'm concerned, death suits you better. I'd bow if I could, Your Majesty. Forgive me. Had I known the Witch in the Woods was Freya herself, I never would have suggested this. Freya? The goddess Freya? You didn't know either. Sorry. When word gets out that Mimir is free, the wrath of Odin won't be far behind. You are God. Leader of the Vanir once, yes. But no longer. You did not think it important to tell me. Are you really going to lecture me about that? We are leaving, boy. But... Now. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Why did you do that? We cannot trust her. Because she's a god? Have I taught you nothing, boy? But she's helped us a lot. She lied. Some people value their privacy. Best not to judge, brother. When I require your counsel, Head, I will ask. Fair enough. Get me to Tyr's temple in the Lake of the Nine, and I'll get you to Jotunheim as promised. We know the temple. What's there? Only the last living giant in Midgard. Better to tell us the way. The World Serpent? Wait, do you know how to talk to him? Indeed. He speaks an obscure tongue more ancient even than these mountains. None are left in Midgard who speak it. Except, of course, for me. You do? That's true. You wouldn't know it to look at him, but Jormungandr is a sparkling conversationalist. Jormungandr. So, Mimir, why did Freya spin your face? No. Speak of Baldr. He claims nothing harms him. Aye, Baldr is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. The boasting of a god. Everyone has a weakness. Not him, I'm afraid. Baldr is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. You just said that, Mimir. Did I? What is the source of this power? 
Well, as I recall, it involved a... Uh, a spell? Mamir? Parts of my brain must still be coming back to life. Just need a moment to finish waking up. I hope he's not broken. Hmm. <laughs> That's exactly what you needed. A broken head. Mamir, we're on the lake. Perfect. Dock us near the bridge. Ed, how do we speak to the serpent? There's a horn on a platform at the middle point of the bridge. Take me to it. Final! That horn! Come on. Good. Now put my lips to the horn. Or, you know, they could blow it themselves. Why do you have to do it? Sleeping. What you want? Oh, look, a snack. Ah. Um. Why is he doing that? Odin had that statue made in honor of Thor, and seeing as the world suffered absolutely abhors the fat dauber, he was probably sick of looking at it. But. Doesn't that hurt? Well, he and Thor have a bit of an unpleasant history between them. Or they will, anyway. So I guess waking up to see it was worse than the thought of lumps of solid stone passing through his gullet. You want me to ask him? No. Our only concern is your name. <laughs> travel to Jotunheim. Second, we need to carve that rune into the special gateway. Is that one of the people we first met you? Correct. Except the giants, in their infinite wisdom, saw to it that no ordinary chisel would do the job. Only the tip of a magical chisel opens that gate. Luckily, I know where it is. And it's not far. Well, look, look the, the hammer. Now that, you thought I said you were friends of Odin. You'll forgive me. I never spoke in the ancient tongue sober. Uh. Wait, look! The water has dropped even further. You can see more of the realm towers and statues. I haven't seen new places to explore along the shore. Where is this chisel? Find me a boat, and we'll go from there. So when we get to the boat, we can either look for that special chisel now, or go exploring for a little while. 
I'm happy with whatever you want to do. I'm sure you are. There's a boat. Conveniently placed. Which way to the chisel? Keep rowing towards the statues of the oarsmen, then thread past between them. did tell me why Freya spit in your face. Well, she blames me in large measure for her present circumstances, and not totally without reason. It all goes back to the long war between the Aesir and Vanir. Prior to that, wars for the Aesir were easily won, but the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. Both sides suffered tremendous losses, and for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore. But a rather senseless waste of precious life. Wouldn't you agree, brother? Mm. Precisely. Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy, a certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people. A selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. Cool. from this realm too early. Good. The special chisel is ahead past this game. Okay, here we go. Oh, great. A dark elf. This chisel we seek, what is it? I'm glad you asked, actually. I have just the story for you. <clears throat> there was a giant once named Thamir. A very giant giant. Who, despite his mountainous size, was without question the greatest stonemason this world had ever seen. Proud Thamur hoped to one day pass his vast knowledge onto his son. But young Hrimthur had the heart of a warrior. Perhaps the father had too much fear in him, or the son too little. Either way, a quarrel of theirs spiraled out of control, and the overworked stonemason, bonk, struck his son. Arimthur ran off into the night. Feeling shame and regret, Thamur chased after his son, but in his emotional state soon found himself wandering Midgard, lost and alone. Sadly, he caught the eye of the one person he didn't want to meet alone that night, so far from home. Thor. And what happened next? 
You'll see. What killed him? Oh, no. He fell in the village? Aye. When Thamar fell, he crushed a charming place famed for worshipping the Vanier god Njord. Thor always took credit for planning that one. The truth is, the sweaty ball bag just got lucky. Damn. Dangerous beast. We will take him down together. Did I tell you to fight? Where did he go now? Ow. Of one, yes, a very, very giant chisel. All right. Take my credit, thank you. There it is. Now we go. It's already. Chain's already down there? Yeah, I think so. What happened to the survivors? Oh, Thamur was a frost giant. When he died, his final breath froze everything. Can't get through here. We'll need something to get through this one. The chest. Chests are always nice. Ooh, what you look like? No, I really don't like that. <laughs> I like having like one arm exposed. I like kind of keeping it true to how Kratos looks in the like cover art or display. So, I will see. I don't like the big chest piece at all. Maybe I'll put that one on. The little uh, tip of that chisel. That's the magic shoulder. we need. Damn, it's in his head. Enemies. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We attack? Well, you already did. Who told you to attack? I did not mean to do that, but all right. Look out, 
Adequate. Adequate. Ah, oh, I can open this. Oh, yeah. Oh, you don't have sockets? Uh, that's fine. I'll take this, though. Excuse you. Thank you. One more. Alright, where, where's this final one? Hey, how did World choose that? That's Andy. Alright, I'll find this last one. Read it. Yes, sir. Read it, boy. To Njord, we offer back the sea's bounty. Ah, yes. It was believed that Njord calmed the winds and seas for the fishermen. For that, they loved and worshipped him here. Gotta find that last one. Ah, there it is. I'm sure you could just open the chest. I don't think you have to punch through it. Wait a minute. All that for one of these? You're joking, right? I feel like I got screwed. I don't care what this is. I feel like I just got screwed. Well then. I'm disappointed. Oh, this is gonna be a mistake. I'm calling it now. Oh, never mind. Thought a big thing was gonna spawn.
How are we getting down there? I have a plan. You do? Do not act so surprised. Oh, no offense, brother, but I don't even think Thor with Mjolnir in hand could get through that much ice. Then Thor is a fool. This should be entertaining. Boy. Ready. Stop backing up. Freezing incoming. How is this not breaking through that ice? It's a lot of force. Second, Sindri, I'll be there in a minute. Anything in here? Nope. Right. Wow, that was uh, something that uh, fight. Here, catch. Well, that was a waste of a perfectly good hour. How were you <laughs> seen? There is nowhere here to hide. Oh, that. It's a little trick my people can pull. A special way of not being seen. You can be invisible? More like I can step into the realm between realms. And your mind doesn't understand what it's seeing, so... It sees nothing at all. That's how we avoid ever having to actually use the weapons we craft. It, uh, it doesn't seem to work on dragons, though. <laughs> Your brother wanted to know if you're getting enough to eat. I guess I could tell him you are. Brock was asking about me? Was there meat on his breath? <laughs> <laughs> you let him touch this again. <laughs> Come on, then. Uh. 
<laughs> so that's how Brock was in the temple right after the water drop. He stepped between realms. Okay now, shush. I need complete silence for this. Think. There you go. To work we go. Yeah. Oh, here we go. This is what I'm talking about. I need a lot of that stuff, so... Can't do it yet. It's okay. Yeah, I need a lot of stuff. Uh, axe pommels? Ooh. This one might be nice, actually. Vitality and defense, less runic, and it's cheaper. No, it's the same price, never mind. This gives more bonuses in general. Although, this gives me more vitality. Also, does this one. Actually, we'll go with this one. Nice. I don't suppose you can try keeping that clean? No. no. I do need to get leveled up, like I'm lacking on a lot of stuff. Where are you good for something? Oh. Did I not equip it? Alright, I'll equip it in a minute. Don't have enough silver. Alright, I'll have to wait. Oh! Oh, that's nice. It's not bad. Alright. Let's see, what could I sell? Sell some old stuff? Yeah, I don't need this, so. Where were you even carrying those? Well, that's something. Valid question, actually. They have no other use. Okay, so sell all. They have no use. They have no other use. That should tide you over. Nice. Now I can do more stuff. Uh, what do you have your eye on? It's not bad looking. And back. back to you. Don't forget. Mark of the Ranger. Wash your hands. Where shall we begin? Oh, 
Oh, we can't forget you. I think you'll be clean, young man. Nice. Looking good. Ah, what more do you need? No, oh, that's too expensive. Four, four, four. Why am I not level four then? I think that's a keeper. Oh, is that a keeper? Is that a keeper? Can't do that. Can do that. That looks amazing. I would hope so. Still, still not level four yet. Almost there. That should tidy up your knapsack. All right, we're good. more? Let me think. All right, so now we can uh, continue. Found anything good in Fafnir's storeroom, like maybe a whetstone? Oh, it's plenty of yours. Can you guess it? Knowing you, it doesn't involve standing around here. Correct. But how do you for? Boy. Tomo really liked jewelry, didn't he? he? Even braided his beard with it. I happen to think he looks dashing. You know, for a snow-covered corpse. Clearly missing something. Pick that up. Am I am I crazy? Thank you. Careful. My shop's right here. Yeah, big baby. We heading into that building? Yes. You think there's something inside that'll help us break the ice and get to the chisel tip? No. I'll keep thinking. You know what, Atreus, while you keep thinking, I think we're going to go ahead and end this episode here. I uh, hope you guys did enjoy this video. We got it all done. I actually didn't think we'd uh, we'd get past, the, um, past this little sequence. So we did a good amount today. Maybe, uh, maybe soon we'll do a little bit of a side mission episode. I think it'd be pretty fun. I think everyone would like that. Uh, but alright guys, I'm going to be going now. Hope you all have a great rest of your day. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like button. Subscribe if you guys are new. And I'll speak to you guys in the next God of War video. And until then guys, take it easy. And goodbye.